Hello, I'm Florence Iliana, and today I felt the urge the, that Abba Yahweh put on my heart, the urge to share this uh, message with you today. And it's about a dream that my little sister had in the spring, back uh, the spring of 2020. And this dream that she had was about the coming Antichrist. And in her dream, she saw many pyramids, and on the pyramids, there were faces, uh, there were uh, demon faces on the pyramids. And then she heard the father, Abba Yahweh, sent uh, two angels to seal her. And then God showed her that the next celebrity to appear on the scene would be the Antichrist. And at some point, she saw the demons and the Antichrist coming straight for her. And she started uh, saying, cover me in your Holy Spirit, cover me in your Holy Spirit. And then when the enemy would, would attack her and the demons, the punches and the attacks would, would go like straight through her. And she said it was like a ghost. She would not feel the attack. And then um, at some point in her dream, she also uh, saw that she was on a platform and that Jesus was with her on this platform and she had this uh, she, she had this moment where she, where she said to herself oh wow I can go and hug Jesus right now he's here uh, and then she realized that uh, Jesus Yeshua was was very busy he was uh, very busy helping other people on a, another platform, like at another level. I think it was, she said, from what I remember, it was a lower platform. And he was putting his hands down and he was um, putting, helping to, um, he was putting backpacks on people. And she also said that she heard the Yeshua, Jesus, uh, tell uh, these people uh, the following verse from Genesis 4-7 If thou doest well, shall thou not be accepted? And if thou doest not well, sin lieth at the door, and unto thee shall be his desire, and thou shalt rule over him. So I think this I think what this means, anyways, for me, what I see is that the coming beast system that is uh, that is coming will be uh, we will have a lot of tribulation for those who are believers in Yeshua Messiah, and also the beast, uh, the mark of the beast that is that is going to be that is coming. Uh, we it's going to be a temptation maybe for some because it's going to be there's going to be so much tribulation. But we have to overcome so that we are accepted by Yeshua. And that is really, really important because uh, I, I just see so many churches that, that I've, like, I don't hear them talking about this, about especially the Mark of the Beast. And I'm a little bit concerned that if they, uh, to me, it is clearly uh, the vaccine because it has, like, the snake bite in it and... Um, it's it's just if re you research it like Anthony Patch for example he he d explains it very very well and that if the people the believers the Christians are not aware of this they might uh, like the Bible says that even the elect if possible might be deceived so it's a time really it's really important to be in the Word of God and to to read the word for yourself because if like the churches the pastors are not telling you about this this deception then it's really your responsibility to look it up for yourself so that uh, that you're not deceived and also that even if it comes to uh, to uh, like to um, not uh, taking it even unto death then that is that is what we must do. It's kind of like uh, in the book of Daniel, it talks about like how uh, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, and Daniel uh, were at some point they were they they were forced to worship an image, 
and if they did not worship that image, uh, they would be sent in the like in the furnace that was uh, uh, in a furnace of fire, and they did not uh, they they did not um, uh, how can I say they did not do the king's order, and so they were actually sent in that furnace. So we have to be ready in the same way to do likewise, and e even in that furnace. They were, uh, there's a fourth person that appeared. So I think that means like that Yeshua was there with them through all these trials. So even, even then, like when we are like going through severe tribulations and hardship, Yeshua, Jesus is with us. We, he, he, it's, it's, he endures, like he is there in our trials. So that give, that should give us hope that we, this is like the best hope of all, that we have our Savior with us and He will, He will, He will help us overcome if we ask Him and if we stand strong to the end. Like He says, those who endure to the end will be saved. And for those who have not yet accepted uh, Jesus Christ Yeshua and have not uh, believed on Him, and repented for their sins I I urge you today please please repent the time is so short and like I hear so many uh, people uh, having dreams that the ark is closing the ark that means like Yeshua Jesus Christ is the ark and if the doors of the ark are closing that means there is the time is really short for you to to get saved and to have your name written in the Lamb's book of life. So I pray this message message blesses you, and I pray that you uh, take this to the Most High, and may you have a blessed day.